OK, well, let's up the level of complexity and find more interesting formulas involving exponents. So here's the next one I want us to take a look at. Let's consider x to the fourth raised to the third power. What does that mean? Well, if we think about it, it means that I have x to the fourth times x to the fourth times x to the fourth. Right? I have x to the fourth being multiplied by itself three times. But we know what to do now. Since we have the same base and are multiplying, we add, we add the exponents. And so I see x raised to the 4 plus 4 plus 4, which you'll notice is x to the, well, 4 times 3, which equals x to the 12th. Well, the x to the 12th is the answer, but I'm more interested in this answer here because I see what to do when I have a power raised to a power. What do I do? I multiply the powers together. So I multiply the 4 by the 3, and I get 12. That inspires, and in fact, is the genesis for the proof of the power of a power property. If a is any non-zero real number, and m and m are integers, then if I take a to the m, and I take that quantity and raise it to the n power, the answer will equal a raised to the power m times n. So we multiply the powers when, in fact, we're raising one power to another power. So let's try this with this little example right here. So let's see if we can simplify the expression c squared all cubed multiplied by c to the fifth squared. Well, what I'm going to do here is deal with the parentheses. Remember, orders of operations, we're going to deal with these parentheses. So what happens here? Well, this term right here is going to be c to the, and I can use this fact, Multiply the 2 by the 3, and I get 6, times c. And again, I take the 5 and multiply it by the 2, and I get 10. So what do I see? Well, now I can use the other property we saw, which is I have the same base, and I'm multiplying. What do I do? Do I multiply these? No. I add them. I've got six factors of c here, and I've got 10 more factors of c here. All told, I have 16 factors. So I add the 6 and the 10, and this simplifies down to c to the 16th. Pretty, pretty, pretty cool.